Hello, Floppy Cats YouTube subscribers. Today we are doing the final review video for the JW Pet Grip Soft Rotating Teeth Combs. I did not do an arrival video for the larger one. The larger one came um, on a different day. And it's larger because it's just, you know, bigger in that sense. But this is a medium spacing and then they have and then this one has a fine spacing and a coarse spacing on the same comb see how the teeth are closer together on one end and um, further apart on the other hey i am going to brush trig with the jw gripsoft rotating teeth comb um so that it comes in two different sizes this one has the same spacing throughout whereas this one has a fine and a coarse um, differentiation. Whenever I'm talking in videos, I always think about when I listen to them later, I'm like, why did you say that? Um, and that was one of those moments I was like, hmm, I probably could have come up with a better word for that. Okay, so I did the arrival video on this one and um, I have my sister over here helping me videotape today. So we're gonna just do this one at the same time because um, it's basically the same product other than the, the tines are a little bit closer together. Uh, one of my subscribers readers talked about how her cat doesn't like these kind of rotating combs because they jingle too much. And this one, definitely the bigger one, jingles way much more than this one, little one. This little one I've put through the dishwasher four times already. So, um, and the reason I wanted to know if it was dishwasher safe is for like fleas and stuff like that. You are so cute. And um, the bigger one just to get more surface area and that sort of thing, but it does, oh, sorry, baby. It does jingle way much more, but obviously you can tell Trig that isn't um, bothered by that. Okay, so of all the cat combs and brushes and all that kind of stuff, um, in that we've product tested and reviewed and stuff like that these guys um, by the jw pet are my favorite for their mane like when they get that nasty wet stuff on their mane uh, and they're like cat food or you know like it's changing seasons and the hair is getting stuck in their mouth um, i love just to come in with one of these real quick and brush it out so that's what I like it most for. And then it's also great for their tail. So he's not very willing about the tail right now. So scary. <laughs> I thought he was gonna bite him. <laughs> He'd be a good kitty. He gets a lot of hair at one time. Um, oh, okay, now we're gonna talk about how much we hate being combed. Okie dokie. Um, this ooh, ooh, ooh. this one's great for mats as well. It finds mats I didn't even knew existed, or maybe that were starting out to. I know it's rude. It's rude. Um, and all that kind of good stuff it gets out. It does a good job at collecting it. And okay, so we have another JW uh, comb that is not rotating tines is that what the word is and I don't I, that's the one I always grab if we have a mat problem or whatever I just that always tackles the issue but I have to say that the cats have been way more receptive to the rotating te teeth that's the name of it um, way more receptive to the teeth on the rotating one than they have been on the the ones that are stagnant, that don't move. Okay, so this one, I think what you do is you just use half the comb or or this side of the comb. And this, uh, or this review video will be in our final review on floppycats.com and I will have actually run this through the dishwasher by then. So I'm going back with the finer side to get even more tail hair. He is thrilled about this. 
Okay, so I, I've done coat videos of like the differences between Trig and Charlie's coat. So my parents' cat, Camus, he's a rag doll. He has a very uh, bunny rabbit-like fur coat. And if you see these little like longer hairs, <laughs> hold on, Chiggy, let's get him up. <laughs> he's rubbing Amy's finger who's fil filming this. There's little finer hairs that stick up beyond their coat that you don't really notice, like even in here. Um, and I didn't notice them until they were gone. And when they were gone was when we were product testing the Shed Monster, which is a shedding brush. And uh, my dad kind of went to town on Camus, removing tons and tons of fur. But what happened was it took all of the sheen out of his coat. So I, for that reason, am not a big fan of the shedding um, blades and stuff like that. But if your goal is to get your cat not to have, a, well, not to have a lot of cat hair in the house and also not to have hairballs because of cat fur, although hairballs is, is a diet issue as well, primarily a diet, diet issue. So that's why I like the combs because they don't re remove that finer stuff. So right here, this is exactly what I'm talking about. These little clumps of whatever wonder um, are what I like to use the comb on. So I just take it and he is pretty good about it. Oh, thank you. Oh, I really want to kill that comb, but I'm just going to let her do it because this is what she does. Oh, she does. Okay, and Charlie's got these, like his little pantaloons stick out. And I like to get those little things too. And now I'll get his tail. Oh, he's not gonna like this. Oh, he's got distracted by something. No, not for long. <laughs> All right, so that is the little guy on him and the big guy again. I think you just use one side, the side, you'd use the wider side to start out with and the finer side to finish off with if your cat liked being brushed and didn't have a tail like this where he was pissed off. You good kitty. I don't want to leave. Thank you, baby. Okay, bye, Ray. I'll leave you, bye. So that is our final review of the JW Gripsoft Combs. These um, are probably going to be staples in my house. I should say I might donate this one. I really like this little guy um, more just because of the size and also because um, I really like the rotating teeth. Uh, I really think that that helps Charlie and Trig. Oh, maybe not so much right now. He's pretty pissed off right now because of... <laughs> Is your tooth cut? Oh, you're just chewing on it? Okay. Let's see if you did any damage. No, just not too much. And do again. What if it? But oh. <laughs> um, I'm gonna keep it because my cats love these combs so much. No. <laughs> Bubby, why do you hate being groomed so much, sis? Uh, because the rotating teeth. Um, don't, no, don't leave, don't leave, don't, don't leave. Thank you, thank you. I'll let you so much. Oh, I'm gonna bite you. <laughs> Bob, it's okay. I'm sorry, sweetheart. I know you hate combs. In other circumstances, he does not mind the rotating teeth as much. He still hates combs, still hates being combed, but he doesn't mind the rotating teeth as much. So that's why I'm gonna probably keep it and... This one I'll probably donate to my sister or my mom for their kitties. Um, but what if I just want to touch it right there? Oh, down, down, boy, down, right there. Oh, cannot touch in me. I'm a Charlemagne. No brushes or combs can touch the Charlemagne. Whoa. <laughs> okay, Bubby, it's just all done. It's all done. It's all done. All right, if you want to order either one of those combs, uh, 
I will include a link in the about section below to where you can order it. And I'll also include a link to our arrival video because that will show you like how it's packaged and how it comes and all that good stuff. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It helps my channel grow and helps us bring you more products. Charlie's like, please do not like this video. We do not need any more combs. I hate combs. I hate brushes. Do not like this video.